the tailgate. It's an American tradition unlike any other. Filled with food, drinks, and friends, this pregame party is a tradition richly steeped in history. According to National Geographic, the first tailgates date back to 1861, when civilians gathered in Washington, D.C., picnic baskets in tow to watch the first Battle of Bull Run. Then came the chuck wagon. Invented by Charles Goodnight in 1866, the chuck wagon was a Westerner's traveling cafe. Pulled by mules, these wandering wagons served up hearty meals to many soldiers on the go. A few years later in 1869, sports and tailgating would merge for the first time at the inaugural football game between Princeton and Rutgers. Fans gathered around chuck wagons and droves for the first time wearing different colors to represent their team. Over a century later, tailgating has grown into a phenomenon that transcends sports. But no matter where you may go, there's nothing quite like a tailgate in Tuscaloosa. We've been tailgating out here on the quad for 12 years and we will tailgate until our great grandkids quit setting up. We've been in this spot since my sophomore year of college, so that would have been 2007. So this is, I guess, our 10th year anniversary. Tailgating in Alabama, I would imagine, is like synonymous. One goes hand in hand. The, the atmosphere out here is just wonderful. Honestly, my favorite thing is getting here about 7.30 every morning <laughs> and cooking breakfast. You got Denny Chimes in the background. I enjoy seeing all the little children in their Bama gear and their parents training them right. You know, it'd be a good Bama fan. In a little while, the band will be practicing over here, and then they'll do their, their elephant stomp over to the stadium. And it's just a lot of fun to be here and be around everybody. So I came down here with seven other guys. We're from uh, Ann Arbor, Michigan. Gypsy, New York. Uh, born in Mobile. We're St. Louis. St. Louis. I'm living in Ohio right now. Kansas City. We know that um, Southern hospitality is always uh, paramount uh, when people are from out of town, and uh, we always look forward to it. If you're a true Alabama person, like these people are, uh, this is your element. This is basically what we do. We don't go on fabulous vacations, although one time we did go to Gatlinburg. We were on the quad when you could drive your vehicle up to right there and unload. There was nothing like this. Nothing at all like what you're seeing now. Some members of the Tide family can remember tailgating at Legion Field in Birmingham, Alabama. Due to its size and location, for most of the 20th century, the majority of Alabama's home games were played at Legion Field, with the Tide's final game taking place against South Florida in 2003. And while the confines of the Quad and Bryant-Denny are better suited for SEC crowds, some fans still enjoy to reminisce about the good old days in Birmingham. Well, we, we've probably been tailgating since the uh, late 70s, and you know, back, back during that time, we were playing all of our big games at Legion Field, so that's kind of where it started. And we started in the backyard of a, a nice lady that lived in the neighborhood named Miss Wilson, who used to take care of us. And it was like tailgating in, grand, in grandmother's backyard right there by Legion Field. Some friends and ours were definitely one of the first people to ever stake a claim out here. We, we came out here, and there, there, there might have been five or six people actually tailgating out here. And, uh, so we kind of staked the claim, a few more people came, and it really boomed when our kids come to school here. Today, tailgating is an evolution of all these bygone behaviors. No matter the location or the event itself, a tailgate is a sure bet for a good time. Moreover, it's an opportunity to connect with countless friends, families, and even strangers. Like we, we tailgate with the same people every week. And that's what makes it so good, just the friendships that we've made. Yeah, I just get to come out here and visit with my friends and my family and spirit. I think Alabama football is a multi-generational thing and this tailgate experience is just lots of families, lots of age groups, lots kind of epitomizes southern gentility and hospitality, so I think it goes hand in hand. You sit out here with all these people, you know everybody around you, and everybody just has a blast. That's right. So, and it's all, like he said, it's all about the, the friendships and the neighbors and the brotherhoods. So. Yeah. 